सो हेलो एंड जय हिंद गाइस वेलकम बैक टू योर ओन चैनल सर तन रुवानी टुडे वी आर हियर टू डू द एम सी क्यूज ऑन मैट्रिस 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 टैब्यूलर इज अ रेक्टेंगुलर अरेंजमेंट ऑफ रोज एंड कॉलम्स इट इज रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय कैपिटल लेटर्स लेट्स मूव टू आर सेशन Our first question on the screen is if a is equals to a i j, two into two, where i a j, where a i j is equals to i plus j, then a is equals to option number a one two three four, option number b two three three four, option number c one two one two, and option number d is one one and two two. So our correct answer is option number b. Two three three four. Up next, we now our next question on the screen is if x plus three four y minus four x plus y is equals to five four three nine, then the values of x and y are y x is option number a is x is equals to two y is equals to seven. Option number b is x is equals to seven y is equals to two. Option number C is x is equal to three, y is equal to six, and option number D is x is equal to minus three, y is equal to seven. So our correct answer is option number A, x is equal to two, y is equal to seven. Let's see the solution. Give me a minute, please. Yeah, here comes our solution. You can see that. Wait, let's clear this. So our next question on the screen is already there. Our next question is if x plus two y minus y three x seven is equals to minus four three six four, then the values of x and y are x is equals to two, y is equals to three. Option number B, x is equals to two, y is equals to minus three. Option number C, x is equals to minus two, y is equals to three, and option number D is x is equals to three and y is equals to two. Our correct answer is option number B, x is equals to two and y is equals to minus three. Let's see the solution for this. You can see the solution. So our next, let's move to our next question. Our next question on the screen is: If x minus two y five is equals, if x minus two y five three and y is equals to six five three minus two, then the values of x is option number A is minus two, option number B is zero, option number C is one, and option number D is two. So our correct answer. Is option number A? No, our option number D. Our correct answer is option number D. Two. So let me show the solution to you. You can see the solution here. So let's move to our next question. Our next question on the screen is if x plus two y three y four x two is equals to zero minus three eight two. Then the values of x minus y is option number A is minus three, option number B is one, option number C is three, and option number D is five. So our correct answer is option number C. Let's see the solution. Just a minute, please. You can see the solution. So let's clear this. So let's move to our next question. Our next question on the screen is: If x two plus two upon if x two three plus y minus one zero is equals to ten upon six, then the values of x and y are: x option A x is equals to two y is equals to six. Option B x is equals to two y is equals to minus six. Option C, x is equal to three, y is equal to minus four, and option D, x is equal to three, y is equal to minus six. So our correct answer is option number B. You can see the solution also. X is equal to two, and y is equal to minus six. 
so we are moving to our next question our next question on the screen is if b is equals to minus 1 5 0 3 and a minus 2 b is equals to 0 4 minus 7 5 then the matrix a is equal to 2 14 minus 7 and 11 minus 2 14 7 and 11 2 minus 14 7 and 11 minus 2 14 minus 7 and 11 our correct answer is option number d let's see the solution also for this just a minute our correct on this answer is option number d you can see how is it how we are solving this so uh, let's move to our next question our next question on the screen is if a plus b is equals to 1 0 1 1 and a minus 2 b is equals to minus 1 1 0 minus 1 then a is equals to 1 upon 3 1 upon 3 1 2 1 1 1 upon 3 2 1 1 2 option number b option number c 1 1 2 1 and option number d is 2 1 1 2 so our correct answer is option number a let's see the solution also for this our option of correct answer is option number a you can see the solution also So moving on to our next question. Our next question is a is equals to 1 0 0 1 then a square is equals to uh, Option a is 1 1 0 0 option b is 0 0 1 1 Option c is 1 0 0 1 and option number d is 0 1 1 0 So our correct answer is option number c Let me show you the solution there is our solution yes it came you can see it how we are doing so moving on to our next question our next question number 10 is on the screen if a is equals to 0 1 1 0 then a square is equals to 1 1 0 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 0 and 1 0 0 1 our correct answer is option number D, 1001. So let's see the solution for this. Our solution is on the screen. You can see this. Our question number 11 is if A is equals to 0, 0, 1, 0, then A square is equals to A. Option A is A. Option B is 0. Option C is I. And option C D is 2A. So our correct answer is option number B 0. Let's see the solution for this. You can see the solution for this. Let me clear this. Yes. Moving on to our next question. Our next question is if a matrix has six elements, the number of possible orders it can have are option number A is 2, option number B is 3, option number C is 4 and option number D is 6. So our correct answer is option number 4. Now moving on to our next question. Wait. Our next question on the screen is which of the following is the correct notation of a null matrix option this this you can see this this or none of these so our correct answer is option number c so let me clear this now we move to our next and the last so move to, so we move to our next question the second last question if a b are respectively m into n comma k into l matrices then both a b and b a are defined if on if and only if are defined if and only if 
n is equals to k and l is equals to m option b m is equals to n <coughs> and k is equals to l option c m is equals to l and n is equals to l option number d is n is equals to m and k is equals to n m so our correct answer is option number a so let's clear this and moving on to our next question and the last question of this whole session so our next question is question number 15th if a is a mat if a is if a is a matrix of order 1 into 3 and b is a matrix of order 3 into 4 then the order of the matrix obtained on multiplying a and b is option a is 4 and 1 4 into 1 option b is 3 into 3 option c is 1 into 4 and option d is 1 in 3 into 4 so our correct answer is option c 1 into 4 so thank you so much guys for watching this video if you like this if you like this video please don't forget to share and comment on this video thank you and if you have subscribed to the channel please subscribe